we would like to give a big shout out to our sponsor, Sonic Electronics. So check them out for great deals on speakers, head units, amps, subs, wiring, etc. Use discount code PROVOBEAST for an instant 5% off your next purchase during checkout. Provo Beast doing another install today. Today we're doing this on a fishing boat. This is the Northwest Boat Series. Um, basically with this install, we're gonna be adding four speakers. Now this boat did not come with a stereo already included. So we'll show you how to run the wiring, install speakers and uh, give it a little test. We'll show you how to install speakers. We're thinking about doing two speakers in this location and two up front. Now I've run second bloom with my two sets of speaker wire. Now we're also using 16 gauge speaker wire through there along the underside, on the factory loom all the way to the back because we're gonna put our two rear six and a halfs here in the back area. Next here, we're gonna run our speaker wire from our front two speakers and loom those as well. All right, so we've now run the front two speakers just up through the wall here. This is where we're gonna be mounting one here and one here when we cut into it. Um, around one end of one wire to right there so there's plenty of length wherever we decide to actually mount the speaker. And the other one I loomed all the way through and it uh, comes out right there, same thing, so we can mount the speaker on the side as well. So with the radio harness, the, the ones that we will use are four colors. The white, gray, green, and purple, positive and negatives. Those are our speaker wires, and that's what's gonna pull them into these four pairs of speaker wires themselves. So in the boat, this will be, this speaker down here will be front right, which is gray and gray black. Front left, which is white and white black. Um, rear driver side right, which is purple and purple black, and then rear left passenger side, which is green and green black. So that's really how we're going to wire that to our wiring harness. Now we're going to strip the wires, strip the wires, and use butt connectors to really uh, make sure those are insulated. All right, so I went ahead and got all four of our speaker wires hooked up. All right, so I went and plugged all the harnesses in here. All right, at this point, I am underneath the area where I'm gonna place both speakers. I kind of made a template so I can mark on both sides so they're evenly spaced. Cut a hole with a five inch hole saw. And uh, I got my Kenwood speaker. Now go ahead and check out the unboxing of these Marine speakers. This fit. That work great. So we're gonna go get those tightened down and get the wiring in the back hooked up to them. All right, got my speaker wire through, got my positive and negative all hooked up, and let's mount the speaker. All right, there we are. Speaker all mounted. Got the other side done as well. Gotta do a little vacuuming. But radio's on. <laughs> Sounds good, just the radio. Nice thing is we have a little antenna for it. So what we're gonna do is now work on the back speakers. All right, back speakers are in. Same principle as the front. Just cut the hole, mounted the speakers, got everything wired. Thanks guys for watching the channel. We do appreciate your support. That's it for the video here today. If you have any questions about what you saw us install, just go ahead and post a comment below. Uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button and we will see you in the next video.